Damn, you females love the bad boys. Bring you flowers? Meh. Try to overthrow God. Off come the panties. Lamau. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to r slash nice guys. Now, before we get into that lovely content that you all know and love, be sure to like the video, comment down below during the video if there is something you would like to discuss, and afterwards, consider subscribing to the channel and becoming a one of the amazing notification squad. All right, let's get right into that lovely content. Let's go. A bar tweeted a photo of the sign along with the words, if dudes would stop trying to kiss our female bartender's hands, that would be great. Why the female? cashier is being nice to you? Is it because she is uncontrollably sexually attracted to you, or is it because that's literally her freaking job, you cretin? Yeah, that's the one thing that really sucks about customer service. You have to suck up to even the creepy ones. Well, to an extent, to be honest. I'm pretty certain myself and other coworkers that I've been working with have had that point of, you know what, screw it, I'm getting the manager on you. And just remember, every time you either upset a cashier or mess with somebody in customer service, they're gonna make fun of you as soon as you leave, because they are only paid to be nice while you're in front of them. You know what freaking sucks about this? Despite me being nice and bringing you everything you needed while you're sick and when your so-called boyfriend couldn't be bothered to be with you, you're still not willing to go on a date with me. I'm a really nice guy and I guess it's true that nice guys finish last. Um, no. First off, I didn't ask you to show up uninvited to my apartment. I had pink eye, dude. It's really not a good idea for anyone to be around me, hence why my boyfriend couldn't be bothered to be with me. Secondly, you're completely right. You have all the whiny narcissistic arrogance that's pretty much standard with you nice guys. Thirdly, being nice doesn't mean I'm obligated to go out on a date with you, grow up, and move the frick on, shaking my head. Frick you, dumb Clint. You know, you would kind of think you would not want to try to go for somebody who already has a boyfriend and then already mentioned their boyfriend and then ask them out on a date in the same paragraph. Being nice does not mean that she will automatically want to cheat with you. I think I've had the right amount of niceness given. I think you should cheat on your boyfriend and come with me. Hello. It's so funny, you try to be nice to somebody and this is how they treat you. Oh god, they didn't respond in 2 hours and 20 minutes, oh no. My guess would be that this is why we stopped talking before. It's okay, our lifestyles are obviously quite different. I don't always respond to text messages right away or after I go to sleep or with my family. No worries, good luck. You have a different lifestyles if you do not respond back to me. When you're ready for a real dude and a real relationship, you got my number. We have different lifestyles. I would respond when I was free and awake, and when you were like, hello, that made me not want to answer. So yes, different lifestyles. Good luck. Like I said, you're going to be with the one to regret this, not me. When I still see you online dating a year down the road, the only thing I'm going to do is shake my head. This dude is pitiful, and I love the color scheme you chose for your chat log. How fat guys can get female friends. How fat guys can get female friends, but not me. I am nice, polite, respectful guy. Guy, and of course good looking but I can't get a female friend I don't understand why girls hate me for so for no reason but ugly cucks can't get girls I'm so angry I can be confident too but none of the girls want me that is disrespectful and discrimination billions of girls in this world why girls just why are these fat ugly girls really interesting I don't understand my height is 5 foot 11 and I'm athletic why girls care about personality I'm nice Nice is not a personality trait. Yeah, why would anybody ever care what's on the inside? I'm a nice guy. Because apparently in their mind, if you hold open the door, they're then obligated to marry you. Hey, sexy. Do I know you? Yeah, this is Brian. I'm Sarah's friend. Oh, hi. No need to be a rude. I am just trying to be nice. Sorry, I'm a little busy at the moment. Something probably unsightly and needing a magnifying glass. WTH! First off, I'm 16. Second off, I have a boyfriend. That dude can't treat you like I can. Excuse me? I could an amazing boyfriend, but all you sluts go for the guys. I am very happy with my boyfriend. You're such a disgusting person. I'm sorry, which one of us has the need to pull out a magnifying glass to understand what exactly we're looking at? For any guy who has sent those type of photos in the past, I know you probably regret it, but what was the urge to try and send- Like, what do you think was your end goal for doing that? Odds are, it's probably under some kind of false assumption of things. Hi, excuse me, are you single? I see your hand is a woman's, and I am experiencing extreme loneliness right now, so I'm putting myself out there and taking a chance. I'm 38 and live with my grandma and help take care of her. We are best friends, so we really like being roommates. She tells me all the time I have a lot to offer and that I'm handsome. Talk to you soon, and thanks. I'm sorry, what? I feel like shot now. Sorry I bothered you. Please don't feel that way. It's just the wrong subreddit that you're looking in. Good luck in your search, and I hope you find someone good. Go fix yourself. You already didn't care how you affected me. Okay.
Now, I may not be a ladies' man, 10,000 Lord of Desire, but I'm pretty certain using Grandma is not a uh, power play. I know you won't send me a boob pic, but definitely don't want to frick, but maybe get flashed in person for birthday? Please don't get mad at asking. I'm a blunt FWD nice guy. No Facebook. I have a snap, babe. I know you have a snap, and no. And only guys that are truly buttholes claim to be nice guys. Ouch and double ouch. I'm a blunt, honest, honest. I don't lie, so I say I'm a nice guy. Sweetie, I'm a very nice guy. I'm honest too, and the fact that you claim to be a nice while asking to see my boobs of a woman you've never met only proves you aren't nice. Asking to see something as it's my birthday doesn't mean I'm not a nice guy. I don't give a shot if it's your birthday or not, it's still disrespectful and degrading to women, and the answer is no, learn some respect. I wasn't mean in asking, I didn't say anything mean, I asked you sweet and nice, didn't say anything mean. This conversation is over, it's disrespectful to ask in the first place, and the fact that you don't comprehend that in your nice Nice guy mind that just shows you only view women as sex objects. Okay, I don't know if this needs to be said really, but you probably shouldn't ask to see a girl's chest and use your birthday as the power card. Now, if it was your girlfriend and then just out of nowhere it said, hey, for your birthday, would you like to see my boobs the other way around, that kind of thing, that's a different story, but not this case. B day is not double D day, so don't try. So, long paragraphs don't work here, apparently. Pros, stability, reliable, a gentleman, intelligence, a sense of humor, and actually can cook. Cons, indecisive times, sarcastic, nice guy, because none of you want one even if you say you do, lol. No car, no job, no intelligence, swipe left, alright, and which one of those three do you have? If you're going to use Tinder to try to look cool by degrading other people, congratulations, you're posting up your own red flags. Also girl, you simply must get rid of the photo of you in that grey sweater dress. LOL, why is that? Because your new first photo showed up in my feed, and I thought, who is that? The grey sweater thing makes you look completely out of proportion when you definitely are not. If you look at that dress, it's adding dimensions to specific specific areas usually intended to make bigger girls look less big, but for someone with your physique, it makes you look not flattering, compared to the black dress. Wow, you know a lot about fashion. I know a lot about what does and does not look good on people, lol, especially ladies. And looking at all of your photos again, you are way more attractive than I initially concluded. Your initial reaction was, I wasn't that attractive, why did you swipe right, lol. You seemed reasonably attractive, but I was not sure. And you move quickly, haha. <laughs> Never mind, I thought you removed the photo already. Yeah, you know. Why try to get them in your pants when you can just skip to the chase and start degrading them? Majority of women like bad men. The good men are single, left to die alone. Ever heard of the saying, nice guys finish last? I never feel bad when women get beat up by their bad boyfriends slash husbands. They know what they're signed up for. She rejected all the good men to chase the butthole. How are you, pretty lady? Hello. Did you just leave me on red twice? Three times? You're playing games. Yeah, nice guy, how's it feel to be 0 for 4? Hello? It's because of behavior like this that gentlemen like me turn bad and start hurting. I didn't? I made the effort to ask you to go for drinks and you've turned me down. But were quick enough to take a drink off me the other night. Well, I'm sorry? You turning this date down is a massive disadvantage for you. I'm highly successful in my career, and I'm going places you seem the type with no ambition. You're not my usual. I have lowered my standards, but thought I could mold you into what I wanted. It seems being nice gets you nowhere. Oh no, I turned down the date. Now I won't be able to let another person change me into what they want me to be instead of what I would like to be. In addition to being nice not being a personality trait, your wallet is also not part of your personality trait. I repeat, your wallet is not part of your personality. How many women my age despise the sight of me? 100%. How much do women despise the sight of me? With all of their hearts, it's my personal opinion that women prefer men who are physically attractive, have muscle cars, mansions, and pools, and play sports. It's just not fair. I give tons of love towards my friends, and what do I get in return? Jack shot. I guess it's the story of my life. Nice guys always finish last. So what you're saying is people that actually have interesting qualities about them get the girls? Weird. I didn't not know that before. And not only that, the whole athletic thing? Cool, so they do something in their spare time aside from sit behind the internet and complain. It's funny seeing all these people, presumably girls, asking if all guys here are players or loyal. Like yes, good guys still exist. Yes, some of us still care and want to do the most for you. No, you will never notice it. But don't blame that on us, haha. <laughs> some of us guys really do be out there trying to have then one night. 
I saw this happen to most girls in my high school. Classic, they reject the nice ones who usually grow up to be successful and then they go after the jerks who end up as druggies or abusive or don't care about them or get them pregnant and then leave or cheat on them. Should I keep going? No point. It'll take days. Uh, fortunately for you, you seem like that type of person who has enough time around the house to be able to post that kind of stuff on the internet, you know, instead of being, you know, a normal person and doing something else. You know, something that's productive or beneficial for you or somebody else. Other than that, you're just wasting your time. Alrighty, and that's gonna have to be it for the video. If you would like what you had seen, be sure to like the video, comment down below what you liked about the video, and consider subscribing to the channel and becoming part of the amazing notification squad. I'll be sure to see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, and bye-bye.